Hi, this is Sridhar. Mm, now I'm going to explain you about a few more options available in Unix uh, in set command in Unix. If you want to uh, in set command, if you want to add a new text after you find a match, you are searching for a pattern called Unix in the file file.txt, and if it if it finds the pattern, you want to add a new text after this pattern after this after the line contain this pattern you want to add a new text then in that case you will be adding an option called a parameter the a command it will tell the set to add a new line after the match is found to add a text in a new line after the search pattern found let me execute this command before that I am listing the contents present in the file.txt now I am searching for the pattern unix unix pattern is found in the first and the third line and after it finds the pattern it will add a text in a new line after the search pattern a means after the search pattern so this line uh, add a text in a new line after search pattern unix this entire line will be added after the line that contains unix pattern after this line contains unix pattern after this line the new text will be added after this line the new text will be added and after this line also because this line also contains unix pattern after this line also this new text will be added the option a means it will add a new text after the search pattern after it finds the search pattern let me let me execute yes see this new text is added after the search pattern unix and for the second line there is no search pattern unix and for the third line it finds the search pattern unix and it, the new text is added after this search pattern unix after the line that contains the search pattern unix the new line is added new text is added similarly you can add a blank line also if this in this command said a means it will add what it will add it will add an empty line you have to give enter in this case within single quotes within this single quotes you have to add an enter enter symbol you you are going to add an empty line after all the lines after every line you are going to add an empty line because here you are not searching for any pattern you are not set searching for any pattern simply you are adding what you are adding you are going to add an empty line let me execute separately said within single quotes a means you are adding what you are going to add an empty line empty line then give again enter and close the single quotes the file name file dot txt if you see it will add an empty line after every line that contains in the file dot txt and this backslash symbol is it will be this backslash symbol will be entered immediately after before the last line immediately before the last line you will be entering the backslash symbol so this is a command which you use to add an empty line after reading every line and if you want to add a line before the match you are searching for the pattern unix and if it finds the pattern then a new text should be added before the line that contains the pattern here we have seen a a means that is here we have seen that if it search for the pattern unix and if it finds the pattern unix then a new text will be added after the line that contains this pattern and if you 
mention it as i the i command what it does it will search for the pattern unix and if it finds the unix it will add a new text it will add a text after before the line that contains the pattern before the line that contains the pattern so a and i are just same but uh, the output is the output it displays is just opposite a means it will add a line add a new text after the line that contains the pattern i means it will add a text before the line that contains the pattern here it will check for the pattern unix it will search for the pattern unix and if it finds the pattern then this text will be added before the line that contains the pattern unix if you see unix pattern is found in the first line so before to the first line this text is added and here also unix pattern is found so before to this third line a new text is added and remember this will not affect your original file it will display the content of the file but it the original file remains unaltered so if you want to change the original file also with this with this output then you have to use the redirection symbol you want to redirect this to another file file1.txt so the output will be redirected to file1.txt so if you see this output file1.txt the output is redirected to the file1.txt if you didn't redirect then your original file remains unaltered so these are the things add a text before the match or after the and after the match you can also insert the lines if you want to insert any line before the first line or before second line any lines you can give simply you can give this command if you see sorry file.txt is not there but let me check whether file.txt yeah it's there sorry file.txt is the original file if you see the original file inserting first line and second line got inserted where it in where it is inserted it is inserted before the first line the original first line is this one before to this first line these lines are inserted inserting first line and inserting second line and all the new lines should be ended with the backslash symbol except the last line except the last line all the lines should be ended with the this backslash symbol and here we are mentioning one one means where you want to insert i want to insert in the first line so if i want to insert in the first line then you have to mention it as one let me change the file content this is the original one and i want to insert before second line i want to insert it before second line insert it before two i means i want to insert before second line what are the contents i want to insert inserting first line backslash if this line is the last line then you won't put put backslash here but this is not the last line i have one more line inserting second line if this is the last line to be inserted then you should not put backslash here and single quotes closed and the input file name greater than dollar 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 means here you are redirecting to a temporary file you are redirecting it to a temporary file and that temporary file will be renamed to the original file name let me execute yes list the file.txt before the second line these new lines are inserted inserting first line and second line are inserted before the second line likewise you can insert insert the lines in the file using set command and the next one is the change command change means i want to change the pattern with the given line first it will search for the pattern the set command can be used to replace a, an entire line it will be it will use to replace an entire line with the new line 
the C command it tells you the set command to change the line. So first it will search for the pattern Unix. If it finds the pattern Unix, then that entire line will be changed to the given text. The given text is change line. So this is somewhat like the substitution, but the substitution it will search for a word. If it finds a word, then it will replace with the given word. But here it will search for the pattern. If it finds the pattern, then the entire line will be removed and it will be changed to some other text. The some other, the other text is in given in the given in the command itself within double quotes. Let me execute. said I am searching for the pattern Unix searching for the pattern Unix and I want to change the line contains this pattern I want to change the entire line that contains this pattern what con what content I want to put I want to put the text as change line if I find the pattern Unix then that line will be changed to the given text change line for the given input file file.txt if you see only the second line does not contain Unix, so the second line remains unaltered. Rem else, rest of the lines are having Unix pattern. Unix is found, and here also Unix is found. So these lines are removed and was changed to the given text, and was changed by the given text change line. So C is used for changing the line. The next one is transform. If I want to transform the given characters, if it is in lowercase characters, then I want to transform it to uppercase. Then you can give it in the set command itself. Here I am changing only the for U and L, only for U and L because Unix it should start with a capital letter and Linux it should start with a L caps letter. So I want to change the U and L lowercase to uppercase. Then I will be doing it by using the option Y within single quotes I am using Y if it is yes then you will be substituting an entire word the same command if you use yes then yes the entire it, it will be treated as the entire word UL as the word if it finds the word UL then that word UL will be changed into caps UL but uh, this is not the case here this is the here I am transforming the individual characters so I am ch checking for the U and L lowercase characters anywhere in the file.txt. If I, if I find the lowercase character U and L anywhere in that file.txt, then those characters will be changed into capital U and L. And closing the single quotes. If you see Unix U is uh, changed into uppercase and here also Unix U is changed into uppercase. Linux also L is changed into uppercase and since U is contained inside Linux that one also converted into uppercase. So everything got converted into uppercase. It is just like a TR command, transform command. It will convert all the lowercase to uppercase. It will not consider it as a word, it considered as an individual letter. Mm. UL and convert it into capital UL, it, it will consider this as an individual character not the word the remaining things we will discuss in the upcoming session thanks for watching